a shootout in Highland on Wednesday, August 18, left two San Bernardino Police Department SWAT officers wounded and a suspect dead in an encounter related to the investigation of the shooting that injured a sheriff's deputy the day before in the city of San Bernardino, police said. Police investigating Tuesday's shooting of the deputy were conducting surveillance and SWAT officers attempted Wednesday at 3.38 p.m. to make contact with the suspect, which led to an apparent exchange of gunfire at Victoria Avenue and Rosemary Drive in Highland, police said. After the shooting, San Bernardino police asked people to stay away from the area of Baseline Street and Victoria as they conducted the investigation. San Bernardino Police Sergeant Aquino Thomas said that individual died at the scene. Officials later said the individual, a man police say was a gang member who lived in San Bernardino, was armed with a handgun on Wednesday. Wednesday's shooting left two officers injured, Police Lt. Michelle Mayen said. Detailed information on their conditions was not immediately available, but Mayen said both were alert. They were being treated at Loma Linda University Medical Center, where late Wednesday one officer was in surgery and another was being treated for a gunshot wound. Mayen said there were no outstanding suspects in the shooting of the deputy. The suspect killed Wednesday was identified as Irvine Alikong, 34, San Bernardino, who police said had an extensive criminal history and ties to a San Bernardino gang. A $200,000 warrant was out for his arrest for an assault with a deadly weapon incident in 2019, San Bernardino Police Chief Eric McBride said. Here we are in two days having three officers shot in the city of San Bernardino and our local area, so I think that's something to be said. I think we've had some failures in our criminal justice system as far as keeping these people off the street that have manifested itself into assaults and death onto police officers," McBride said. McBride also alleged that Alikong approached the deputy's patrol car on Tuesday after unloading his rounds for an unknown reason that he speculated as being ominous. I can't address the suspect's motives specifically. But this is clearly a violent individual we're dealing with and he's now attacked three law enforcement officers, Mayen said. The San Bernardino County Sheriff's Department was investigating Wednesday's shooting in Highland, as that city is in the sheriff's jurisdiction.